Uh, I'm currently in Mandogiri, uh, which is in the eastern part of Cambodia. And uh, I'm currently at one of the three temples called Dokkamom, which literal translation virgin is uh, yeah, virgins. A female virgin. A female virgin's Nipple. chest. Nipple. Ash in her chest. Chest is a much more positive word. Uh, and there are three small temples. Um, there's one up here behind me, uh, which is um, the like the temple of um, the grandmother and the young grandmother. Um, there are there's one over this side here, which is the, um, the temple of the grandfather, which is newly built in 2024. 2024. 2004. 2004. And a little bit further down is the one, the, the one of the original one, along with this one up here of the older grandfather, which was you know. Old. Ages, ages sure ago. But I'm not quite sure what year it is. But the old grandfather and this temple here is the one, um, it's the old one where the new one is just across from here. Um, the story behind it, um, I'm not quite sure about the history of it, but the belief behind it is that you come, when you come to Mandogiri, you come here to pray for, uh, for good health, good fortune. And um, say um, and a safe journey. And what you do is you come in, uh, you buy um, dragon fruits, four or five dragon fruits, not two, not three, but four or five dragon fruits. You bring in, and um, they have. You, uh, what we did was we bought the dragon fruits and we bought some. Uh, what is it called? Lighters. Lighters and uh, incense. incense sticks, incense. Uh, but you don't have to buy incense and lighters because they do have them here. Just bring dragon fruit and bring some money with you because, um, yep, bring some money. Because um, the thing is, you come here and you pray for the good, you know, the good fortune, the good luck, um, health. For good health and for a safe journey um, but you also um, there's a bag at, um, on the statue and what you do is you bring your money and you offer that money to um, the grandparents and you just pop it in that pouch and you leave it in there for a while and then you go back and you ask to borrow money from the grandparents and you'll take that money back but you don't spend it you just put it safe in your wallet just fold it up and recognize which note it is and just pop in your wallet and don't spend it and this and it's the belief is that money will bring you wealth you borrow that money to um, as a um, investment. as an investment for your business or whatever that you're doing and um, in return that money will bring you wealth and in the future when you're wealthy you would come back and thank them and you don't have to go to all three temples to pray. You just go to one of the three. That's it. But yeah, that's it. That's the story. The other benefit of coming up here is the scenery. It's so pretty. You like it? It's pretty. It's really pretty. <laughs>